Hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to set up a pickle jar aquarium with no filter and plants and see how it develops over two months with no water changes. The first thing to do is add a base layer of soil to the jar. As it's going to be a closed system and I'm not going to be adding any fertilizer, this soil will provide the nutrients the plants need to grow. I'm putting sand on top as it holds the soil down, keeping the water clean. It also gives me an easier substrate to plant into. Now that the substrate layer is done, it's time to move on to the hardscape. I'm going to use the same materials I used in my 20 gallon scape, black lava rock and spider wood, as I think they look really nice together and I also have some left over. I played about with a few ideas at first and finally decided to stick the wood onto the lava rock and cover the glue with a piece of piece of philander. Next I added a piece of Pogestamon Helferi. I really like this plant and I found it does really well in these pickle jar no filter small setups. I added some cuttings of Limnophila siciliflora, a very fast growing stem plant that will absorb nutrients really fast, keeping the water in the jar clean. As well as a few pieces of Rotala rotundifolia to add a pop of red. For lighting I'm using this clip on LED that I've used on all my other jars in the past. They work really well and you can buy them from my shop linked down below this video. The next plant is Marsilia hirsuta, a plant that I've also found does really well in these kind of setups. It sends runners out through the sand and can quickly take up quite a lot of space, but I think it looks really nice. And if you leave it for long enough, it can grow out the top of the jar. I think the jar is looking really really great and after about a week of being set up a layer of algae is forming on the surfaces. This is actually a good thing as it shows me the ecosystem is up and running and starting to balance itself out. To counteract this all I do is add a couple of adult ramshorn snails and they'll slowly eat away at the algae keeping everything in check. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
After a few weeks, I see a lot of plant growth. The limnophila is starting to reach the surface and the Hydrocolo Japan is also growing up towards the light. The water is still crystal clear and there haven't been any big algae blooms. You can see the new growth on the Rotala where it changes from red to green. After two months, the jars become very stable. The limnophila has grown a lot and the Rotala has also reached the surface. The snails are doing well and there's plenty of algae for them to eat. But there's not too much that it takes away from the overall look of the jar. You can only notice it when you're up close and looking for it. I will continue to keep you updated on this jar and how it progresses. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.